Alright, using the turtle transports, we're gonna go to lot. Why would they make me work in the freezer like this? Was I demoted? I guess you was. Scene? Nope. That's what happens to you for, for charging people a thousand gal, you bastard. They found out your wrongdoings. Oh, somebody was cheap. Found out your wrongdoings and... <laughs> and send you to the deepest dart of... Deepest part of the freezer. Oh crap, what the hell? Get away from me. I think there should be a scene here. Yep. Alright. Let's book it to the shuttle. Okay. It's back where the giant doors were, right? Sophie. We'll be at Fodra soon. Hang in there. Thank you. I'll keep fighting. Good. Me too! I'm gonna go punch a monster in the face! Indeed. I will be right beside you. Uh-huh. Pascal the face-punching monster. Hunter. Pascal? Poisson, what are you doing the here? The overseer told me to come here and offer my assistance. Is there anything you require? No, get out of my face. I should have known Fourier wouldn't come. Hey, that's awesome, Poisson! Now I don't have to dink around with flying the shuttle! Come on, time to put you to work! Yes, ma'am. I could put their costumes, but I felt like I wanted to keep them, uh, you know, at their original... Okay, here we go. Original Watch clothing. Watch carefully, all right? A tinker tinker. A bajoing gajoing. And there you go. Sweet! Both heat ray cannons are online and ready to go. Now we just need to tinker with the shuttle a little bit. I wish we had more time. But what can you do with a bunch of stupid monsters flying around? I don't know. Okay, guys. Poisson and I'll have this fixed before you can say bananas. Bananas. Thanks, Pascal. Let us know if we can help, alright? Okay. Bananas. Was I supposed to skip cutscene? <laughs> bananas! You're lying, Pascal. I said banana three times. There you are. I was wondering where you'd gone. Oh, hi. You know, it's strange to think we'll be leaving this world soon. Sophie comes from Fodra, right? I wonder what it's like. Are you nervous? Yeah, I suppose. A little. But I'll be alright. I'm sorry, Sharia. I'm sorry for dragging you into this. Knock it off. Sophie's my friend too, remember? I'd do anything for her. Mm -hmm. She's the reason I got to see you all again. And now it's like we're all connected through her. It's funny. When we were kids, I thought she was my rival. Rival? Mm -hmm. For what? Uh, well, for, um, you know, lots of stuff. She was mature and pretty and so very strong. Yeah, she was. She's always been kind of mysterious and exotic, you know? But since she comes from somewhere beyond the sky, I guess that makes sense. You could say that. But that won't change the fact that she's been a good friend. Nothing will change that. Yes, I agree. We'll save her, Sharia. We'll save her and come back together. We've come too far to let things end here. Right, let's do this. Let's save our friend. He just didn't get the part when she said rival. Rival for what? Hmm.
You love Ravel. Excuse me, slime head. Oh, oh, that's already used. All right. Why well, they gotta start us all the way over here, huh? All right, let's check if there's a scene between those two. Oh, wait a minute, what's this? Aha, mastery tonic. More death glow algae. No scene, all right. Bananas! That's four time, Pascal. Okay, that should do it. Whenever you're ready, Poisson. Roger. Are we ready? Well, the ship's ready, but that's the easy part. Are you guys good to go? Alrighty then. Poisson, let's do this thing. Understood. Initiating countdown. 200. Damn. 199. All the way from 200. Okay, kids, hop on. Let's go. No pushing now. Plenty of room for everyone. What's that? It sounds like the monsters that struck Log. What? Damn it! The launch procedure is already underway. It would be very difficult to abort at this point. 181. 180. Just keep going, Poisson! Come on, Asbel. Let's go clock some monsters. If they get in here, we'll never be able to launch the shuttle. She's right. We should take the fight to them. I'll keep an eye on Sophie. You guys go. Let's do this. Time to kick some ass. You can tell it's serious because there's no so um save point. <laughs> oh shit. Alright, let's fight these monsters. There they are. As expected, it's the monsters that attacked Lant. There seems to be an infinite supply of these creatures. Look out! Everyone stay on the game! And like that, it was over. All right, time to head back to the ship. They just keep coming. What are we going to do, Asbel? Master Hubert. Bailey, what are you doing here? We saw a swarm of these things and decided to give chase. Now go, get out of here. We'll handle these beasts. Asbel, come on. Thanks, guys. We owe you. What the hell are these guys gonna do? They got their ass ripped apart last time. All right, let's head back to the shuttle. Post haste. Everyone, hurry inside. Preparing to load the shuttle onto the launch ramp. Readying the catapult. Shuttle engines online. T minus one minute. Fifty nine. Fifty eight.
again. Wait! What is that? Just so you could help us. Heat ray cannons, fire! Intense scene. I always love that part. Yeah. Everybody got thrown around in the ship. Is everyone okay? Did we make it? Is this Fodra? Should be. Once we cleared the aquasphere, it felt like we were falling. Yeah, Fodra has a stronger gravitational pull than the world we're used to. Hence, it yanked us right in. Let's get off the shuttle and see where we are. All right. What's this? What do we need? All right, I don't need this shit. That's equipped. It's equipped. All right. Isn't it supposed to have? Oh, I have two of them. Oh shit! I didn't know that. All right. I can sell one. Have more money because I know this shit's gonna be expensive here. Huh. Oh, the casting speed on this is pretty good. So the magic for men. Alright, these are pretty good. I like that. I like that the uh, um the scarves give different appearances too. Well, somewhat. Oh shit! I knew it. All right, I can. I'll buy this. She's not with us, but soon she'll be. Alright, I'll buy her. Damn, her money goes fast. I'll put his accuracy up with something else. Alright. 
His accuracy is going to go down, but... Hold on. That means accuracy and evasion are going to go down exponentially. Alright, put that on you for a sec. Because I know. And then I need to dualize too. I'll do that off camera. I want to. Hold on. Screw it. <laughs> dualize. Um. Um. Whoops. Even though I most likely will freaking um All right, I'll give her that. Dude, you're pretty much, um... Right. Since he can't, he can't heal. Oh shit, oh. Alright, giant hammer. And give her more life. I should really sell all this shit here. Oh, so oh yeah. What the oh, wait, oh shit. Everybody has their stuff on. For now, I'll buy it for... I'll buy it for, um, for Sharia. I hate wasting time doing this. Alright, I'll do that. That'll help. Alright, time to get the hell out of here. This is... Fodra? There's nothing here. It's a wasteland. How could Sophie possibly come from this place? It looks like a great battle was fought here in the past. There are signs of combat throughout the landscape. It's so cold and desolate. There aren't even any plants. See that big round orb in the sky? That's our home. We couldn't see Fodra from there, but we can see our world just fine from here. That's all quite fascinating, but I have a more immediate concern. 
Will this shuttle ever fly again? Ha! <laughs> um, yeah, I don't know. That landing really did a number on it. Wait, are you saying we're trapped here? <laughs> what? So even if we manage to help Sophie, we can't take her back? We still have to find a cure for Sophie, right? We'll just add fixing the shuttle to our to-do list. I suppose we don't have any other options. Yeah, curing Sophie has to be our first priority. We can deal with the other problems later. We need to get the lay of the land. I wonder if there's a town nearby. Hey, come look over here. That building appears to be floating in midair. Well, looky there. I bet that's a city. That's incredible. Maybe we can find someone to help us. We'll never know unless we try. Let's check it out. I'm telling you, Malik is so lazy. But he's lucky he's handsome. Hasn't even thought of um, picking up... <laughs> picking up Sophie and saying, here, let me carry her. No, it's okay. She's not heavy at all. Ooh, secret seed. I know there's a lot of treasure chests around this area. Hello, plant dude. Alright, holy bottle. Oh, he's stepping right where we need to go to. Bastard. Judith Carter. I wonder where she's from. Scene? Yes. No signs of intelligent life. Nothing but some weird monsters. What happened here? Hey Sophie, Pascal says that distant ball in the sky might be our world. Isn't that amazing? <clears throat> Sophie? Asbel, Sophie isn't responding. Hey! Hey, Sophie! Let me see her! Okay, she's fine. You two can chill now. Really? I mean, right. Of course. Of course she is. But if we don't hurry, she'll keep getting worse. Damn it. Why? I don't know. Don't ask me. I promise we're going to save you, Sophie. Just hold on for a little longer. I love Pascal's hairstyle. And i never seen a more serious face on Pascal than now. Telos Astu, the extinct city. Looks like this really is a city. Or at least it used to be. What a mess. Do you think we'll find anyone here? I don't know. This place looks as empty as everything else we've seen here. Hey, there's somebody on the floor! Is that... Sophie? No, but the resemblance is uncanny. What you do, Pascal? What did you do? <laughs> I don't know. I just touched her and then poof. Uh-oh. Hey, I see someone. Stop! Wait! Don't go! Well, at least we know someone's alive. Come on. Let's find them and start asking questions. There's a pink-haired Sophie all the way over there. Look, there's an inn here and a vending machine. Same thing, let me see. I know Sophie's gonna need that. Hyper Scarab. Wait, didn't I have a magical ribbon? Hey, Tofu! Um... 
Wow. Oh shit. That's a lot of money. I know I have a magical ribbon somewhere. Now I can sell the... The Platinum Scarab. Because <laughs> apparently I don't need it anymore. They have stamp cards here too. Alright, cool. Oh, it's the same thing. Alright. Alright, let's go follow this girl. Wait. This is a disquieting place. I hope it's really where we need to be. Come on, let's chase that person we saw earlier. Maybe we should split up. That sounds reasonable, but splitting up may cause additional problems. No, we need to stick together. We have no idea what lies ahead of us. I agree. And we should all be together to protect Sophie as well. All right. I guess I'll save here. The video's only like 26, 27 minutes. But I'll save here and um, look for that little girl. The Sophie look-alike.